Yo, what's good, what's good? We here at the draft party. We got that pick right, let's go. Who did you have? I had Hutchinson. Next I have Iggy Kong. You got Hutchinson? Uh, who did you have? Ahmad Gardner. Uh, so far, we both got $2, let's go. As you guys saw, we ended up trading the 23rd pick in exchange for Marquise Hollywood Brown and the 100th overall pick. And just as I thought the night had peaked, one of the greatest moments of my life had happened. I finally made it on TV. Take a look. Mitch Card continues our team coverage, joining us live from Glendale. Mitch, you were there to see it all. Yeah, uh, to the surprise of everyone here, including uh, this reporter, Marquise Hollywood Brown showed up on stage with owner Michael Bidwell to lots of cheers. Fireworks ended the night, but the real fireworks happened before the sun went down. Early fan reaction, mostly positive, but not 100%. Marquise Brown, you had the connection with Kyler back in Oklahoma. I mean, I'm ecstatic, man. Steve Kahn, y'all did yourself. I'm glad to be a Cardinals fan. I think they should have kept Christian Kurt though, not traded the pick, and you know, they stayed with someone else to pick someone else. Got a got an offensive guard or something. I'm just excited. It kind of reminds me of Aquan Bolden and Larry Fitzgerald back in the day. So Marquise Brown and DeAndre Hopkins, that's elite, man. I'm excited. And then, perhaps even more shocking than the trade. <laughs> Take us through how this came to be. We announced the news. The crowd went nuts once again here in person. But uh, just give us a, a quick recap of uh, how long was this in the works? Well, I, I think it was in the works uh, officially uh, for the last couple of days. And uh, I know it's something that Hollywood wanted. Uh, we've been expressing that. And uh, the, the discussions between Eric DaCosta, the GM of the Ravens, and Steve really heated up over the last couple days. So we were pretty excited about it. And uh, the whole key was to keep it quiet until we got to the 14th pick. Um, it w I snuck up to Las Vegas this afternoon, picked up Hollywood and his girlfriend and got him down here just at the time that the trade went through. Now that comes from your hometown in Florida because in Florida they called you Jet, right? <laughs> yeah, uh, originally growing up, they called me Jet, and then once I got to Oklahoma, you know, I got to Hollywood. Jet, 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 We know your quarterback is excited. He tweeted out immediately, let's run it back. So for those who don't know, you were teammates at Oklahoma and had a spectacular season, your final season together. Tell us about that and just how fired up you are to be reunited. Oh yeah, definitely. You know, he's one of my best friends. We talk every day. So, uh, you know, we've been we've been talking about this for a while. So when it when it finally, you know, was able to happen, we both have been excited and you know, can't stop smiling. What is it that chemistry between a receiver and a quarterback? It's real. It has to be there, and I'm guessing it exists between the two of you. 
Yeah, it's, it's everything. Uh, I know what he's thinking. He know what I'm thinking. And, you know, I've been throwing with him the last couple of weeks, and it's been great. All right, so for the uh, Red Sea out here, they want to know about your game and, and, and how you are as a player. Tell them. Tell them. What can they expect? Uh, you can expect uh, a lot of big plays, a lot of touchdowns. Damn. Damn.